The National Archaeological Museum of Athens contains many images of ancient life. But these depict people dying. The reason why has only recently been discovered. When they were doing the excavations for the new subway, uh, they found two large pits in those excavations, and they had multiple burials in them. And they were all just sort of thrown in together with a lot of pottery. The remains were dated to 430 BC, at which time Athens was at war with Sparta. However, it did not appear that the bodies died in battle. Archaeologists concluded that these were the victims of a mysterious plague that ravaged the city. The symptoms included high fever, bloody sores, and erupting pustules. Fingers and toes fell off. Victims went blind. These victims cannot speak for themselves, but their mouths may still reveal the secret to what killed them. Dr. Manolis Papagrecarakis is a professor of orthodontics. His team chose a well-preserved skull and extracted pulp from the molar to look for telltale traces of bacteria. Έδωσαν απάντηση το αντιστοιχείο αυτό που ήταν για τη σαλμονέλα εντερικά τύφη, δηλαδή αυτό το πρόβλημα που το βακτήριο αυτό προκαλεί τον διφοιδή περιτό. The Athenian war strategy was to bring everybody in from the countryside, and that made for an extremely crowded city. Trapped inside the city walls, the Athenians were at the mercy of their own food and contaminated water. Perfect conditions for typhoid fever. In the end, the plague took the lives of a third of all Athenians. Today, we finally know how they died, solving an ancient mystery. <laughs>